Okay, so this is a first look at TweetBot for the iPad. TweetBot has been on the iPhone for quite a while and it was just upgraded to 2.0 on the iPhone. And now it's come out with a with a iPad version. It's $2.99 and I got it. And it's got a lot of new features like multiple timelines, quick switch. So let's take a look at it. I will go over to TweetBot. I have launched it. And um, when you first launch, Let's see, I just, uh, I'm getting in, and it gives you a little overview of how it works. Powerful gestures. You can double tap a tweet to view details, tap and hold links, and avatars to get options. And so it gives you this little preview. And anyways, here it is. Uh, let's see. Let's go to my Max Future Lex McFarley. So look, it's it's got a very nice user interface. Here's the timeline. I'm looking at it. You got the timeline. Uh, I like the window. It's got a really nice feel to it. Uh, you can see all the people I'm following. You've got mentions. You've got messages, favorites on the left. So it's a very nice, clean user interface. Let's go to the... Um, so you've got here on the left-hand bar, you've got timeline, mentions, messages, favorites, search, profile, list retweets and mute filters so it's very powerful so let's look at the timeline so let's say I was gonna uh, double click on Paul Thoreau and you get this um, nice little pane that shows who he is where you know what his links are how many followers he has and then his messages underneath and I kinda like it, it uh, it's very elegant uh, you got his mentions there you got his favorites and he's got his lists so it's very it's a very kind of nice uh, layout now let's say you want to write a tweet uh, locations not enabled uh, cancel okay so it's a nice sort of interface the um, the keyboard pops up let's see you've got uh, settings there if you want to add location I guess uh, you can add photos and videos. What else you got here? Start typing a tag. It gives you a little hashtag if you wanted to. Uh, so look, it's really, it's very elegant. I really kind of like it. Let's see what the searches look like. The searches are very um, elegant interface too. You can edit the searches. You can delete your saved searches. I have uh, Gizmodo, iPhone, Max Future, Encounter Notions. Done. Uh, what else? Profile. I've got my profile there. I've got my lists. I don't have a lot of lists. I've got my mentions. I get a lot of spam mentions. So this is it. This is TweetBot, two ninety nine for the iPad, and it's. I say it's a very elegant uh, interface, and I kind of like it. So I. I recommend it. Uh, I think it's a very good app for $2.99 for the iPad.